Yo, what's going on, family? This is Tariq Nasheed, and we're doing a very special broadcast right now. We're going to make it short and sweet, and we're doing this on the... Hold on, let me turn that my joint down. We're doing this on the Tariq radio page. Not the Tariq radio, but the Tariq time page. We're doing it on my other page. Glad to have everybody tuning in. Let me turn all these sounds down. Let me get it together. But... We're going to do a quick exposure video, family. This is a quick exposure video. And before I get into that, be sure to go to HiddenColorsFilms.com to get Hidden Colors 1 through 4. In addition to Hidden Colors 1 through 4, you can also get the 1804 DVD. You can get them in a package deal. So go there now. So what we're going to do now, we're going to do a real quick exposure video. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> now there's a cat on, and this is kind of a nobody dude, and y'all got to excuse me because my throat is still hoarse right now, but the balding gentleman that you see on the screen, that's a cat who calls himself C.D. Fury here on YouTube and other social media sites. Now this cat, he's one of these little old buffoons who clout chases by trying to make quote unquote exposure videos of other people so that he can get shy. Now, uh, this is a weenie and this really, you know, he's kind of a peon, but I'm doing this as a life lesson to other people to learn what not to do and how not to be. So this is much of a life lesson to you more than it, it is. It's an exposure to this guy. I'm actually giving him shine by exposing his um, donkey mouth ass. But the guy's name is <clears throat> Raymond Roy Bradshaw. That's his name. Now, again, he has a page called Conspiracy Dude. He's one of these little anonymous fuck boys who talks a lot of shit anonymously. And you see that, you know, he makes videos about a lot of folks. He does a lot of videos about me. And that's kind of the only way he can get hits. But I, I just don't respect anonymous niggas. And, the, you know, the shit he says about me is just real goofball shit. It's not even worth addressing. It's shit like, well, Tariq, like light-skinned women over dark skin. It's that type of goofy fuckboy shit. But just know the kind of niggas that's out there. Now, this is his um, Facebook page, Conspiracy Dude. And you look to the right, it says public figure. So this is why I can go in on him a little bit. I can expose his real identity because he is a public figure. All right, because I don't want people talking about doxing and all this old stuff. But we just got to understand the anonymous fuck niggas that lurk on the net. And we got to start bringing them to the to the surface. You understand? And thank you, everybody, who's putting some on the Melanoid Ministry right now. But since he's a public figure, I can go ahead and let folks know what's going on with this little baby donkey looking motherfucker. You understand? We can let folks know what's going on with Raymond Roy Bradshaw. Now, this cat is from Connecticut. He has some real questionable things going on in his life. You know, one reason when people are acting anonymous, I'm always very weary. What are they trying to hide? And I always say this, when people are anonymous on the internet, usually they got some shit to hide. Now, now he scrubbed the internet of this. Now, this guy has several failed GoFundMe campaigns. He's a dude who kind of watches people like me and see how I do things successfully. Then he tries to do it, but he has failed tremendously. He tried to publish a book like me, and that failed. He had a GoFundMe, and I want y'all to look at this. Now, he scrubbed the internet of this. You got to do some real deep digging to find this because he, he thought that he scrubbed the internet of it, but we found it. You know, you don't really go anywhere. People can find you where they want to find you. Now, on this GoFundMe, that's his name, Roy Bradshaw. He would use his real name on this one. And, <clears throat> excuse me, and look in the description. He says, hi, I go by the name of Conspiracy Dude on YouTube. And about six months ago, I started a video, video series, blah, 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 blah. So this was a few years ago before he went underground, underground. All right? So this is the receipt that Roy Bradshaw is claiming to be conspiracy dude. So now he's, that's the receipt right there. I just want y'all to remember that. So once he started going underground, you know, he he scrubbed the net of his real information and he put up some more 
GoFundMe campaigns. He saw my documentaries doing well, so he tried to do a documentary about the fucking flat earth, and that failed. So he got a whopping $140. That nigga got bottle service money for his failed documentary. Y- you understand? So this, I'm just giving you an idea of the kind of nigga we're dealing with. CD Fury is a lifelong failure. He had another website. Now he changed his name to Roy Brown. All right? He's using the name Roy Brown. He's trying to go underground. And he tried to create a website called helpmen.net. I guess he's trying to go the conscious route. That didn't really pop off. That shit made $15. <laughs> So, you know, this dude is just, his life is a struggle. That nigga made a bag of weed money. So he sees people like me doing all these things and I'm very successful at them. So he tries it. It fails. So then he makes these hating ass videos. He even tried after Mink Slide. This is recent. He tried to do, he's trying to get a music thing going on. CD Fury's debut music album. And he got a GoFundMe for that right now. And that made a whopping 25 fucking dollars. This is the kind of failed Negro we're dealing with. And this is where all his hating videos come from. It's just jealousy. Nothing more, nothing less. This is just a broke, dusty, balding, desperate Negro who's hating. (laughs) And, you know, we did some background on him. He's one of those second-gen immigrants from the Caribbean. You know, who's most of the people who listen to him are white supremacists. So, you know, he's he's the donkey trying to get the butter carrots from Zaddy. You know, he makes these goofy videos. He talks a little slick shit about black folks. And most of his views are from the little white supremacists. So that's where he gets the little car- donkey carrots from them. Now, this is very interesting about the baby donkey. Now, this is the very interesting thing here. Check this. We did some more digging. Looked like this dude got some kind of marriage scam going on because up there in Connecticut where he lives, he gets married. There's multiple documents where he's gotten married and then got the marriages quickly annulled or had disillusions of marriages. So this is one person and I'm not trying to put up too much information. This is public record. So this is in 2007 where he was married to somebody and they got some kind of disillusion of marriage. And then in 2009, here's another person. It's the same dude. He got a disillusion of marriage. So what's going on? Is the, What kind of marriage scam is this nigga running? Is this nigga running some kind of 90 day fiance? marriage scam so you always look at niggas who's always making videos talking about somebody's a scammer somebody's a con but they're hiding you understand you watch niggas like this who always hiding and talking about somebody's a scam this is public record so i don't want to hear that doxing shit but he got some little 90 day fiance hustle scam going on about marriage this nigga's getting married and getting the shit annulled some shit this nigga got going on is he trying to Vanessa Green card? What is this nigga doing? So I'm just giving you an idea of the type of nigga that's out here. Okay, and then this is an other older picture of him. I think he was younger on this picture. His hairline wasn't as fucked up. But on this picture, I think he's younger. So there's only a couple of pictures that exist on the net of this nigga. So he scrubbed the net of all his pictures. So these are the only pictures, the older one with the balding and the younger one where this nigga looks like a bisexual runaway. Don't that nigga look moist as fuck? They got that nigga missing picture on a bottle of soy milk. You know, don't that nigga look like a victim of child trafficking or some shit? Just a real goofy fuck nigga. And he probably wasn't missing. He probably had a trail of gingerbread crumbs leading to his booty hole, so he's just playing hide and go get it. But... (laughs) But just, this is an idea of the nigga that's out here. So this is C.D. Fury, a.k.a. Raymond Roy Bradshaw. So we got to put faces on cats like this who try to make these little anonymous hating videos. See that If you want to be successful, and the lesson we learn is this. This dude has been a failure all of his life. 
he's one of these second gen immigrants who has this I gotta get mine and fuck the black Americans that type of shit this finessing scamming Negro let me tell you something if you want to be thorough you don't get there by hating you get there by soaking up game nigga if you want to write a book get around some folks who write books nigga you could have asked me some game I would have gave it to you so you wouldn't fail you don't have to make hating videos trying to get your clout up and get your numbers up so that people can go and monetize your shit because that's what he does he makes these videos talking a gang of shit so we can get a lot of views and then he tries to monetize the views but the shit never works that's his problem the nigga tries to monetize the views and the shit never works because that's not how you come up and he's one of these niggas that comments under different accounts under his own videos just a fraud all the way so that fraudulent fuckboy shit has to go and I'm telling you the listeners you don't want to be that type of cat anyway y'all that's been it Go check out my other channel. I'm going to go live later on today, but I just wanted to put the bullshit on my alternative channel. Um, go to hiddencolorsfilm.com. Go to minkslide.com. Um, I'm a holler.